websites, you can see the views of the landscape, and it's, I mean, I think even if you don't dive, so much hiking and beautiful views, plants, land animals, yeah, it's just, it's like a hidden gem. Santa Maria is a, a unique place to dive with, uh, with mobile arrays because here we have uh, a seamount called Ambrosio and this is actually one of the only few places in the world where we are able to see big groups of sicklefin devil rays. The great thing about this trip is that it, it encourages your average diver, if you like, if they're diving in places like this and there's manta rays around and they have a camera, everybody can contribute to the project. It's not just the marine biologists going out and shooting these animals to catalogue them. They can have a whole army of people doing it uh, on their behalf. As divers, I, I think naturally we're citizen scientists anyway. On one side, the scientists get the chance to improve the amount of data they can collect and in turn the citizen scientists can have this educational experience and we can uh, raise awareness on the importance of conservation of species or even ecosystems. So Manta Conservation Experience was created to connect the, the normal diver with the conservation work that's being done. The Azores have, have captured my heart and soul. 